This is our optical DAS system. Uh, it's extremely flexible. Uh, we can interface to any RF source. We can take an off-air signal uh, from, a, from a, a donor site using our donor front end. It's basically a, uh, a BDA that's designed to work with our optical DAS system. It fits into the same sub rack and is controlled by the same GUI. Uh, it's band specific, so every service provider would have their own so that we can set levels independently. Uh, we can also interface to a low power base station with our TAPOI card. It takes up to a 30 dBm input. It will accept either a simplexed or a duplexed feed. It also is uh, band specific and service provider specific so that we can control the, the various levels independently. Uh, we can also end up, uh, interface to a high power base station up to a 46 dBm input with our uh, active DAS tray. Uh, this comes in two varieties, a, a single or a, a double. What we're looking at here is, is a dual. Uh, the dual can uh, accept a MIMO feed and uh, process the, uh, the signals independently and pass them through, or it can interface to a dual duplex base station and, and combine them together. So it gives you a lot of flexibility. Uh, this is our system controller. It uh, has an embedded GUI. It can controls all of the active, uh, active components in our system. It can control everything in this sub rack and up to uh, 12 additional sub racks. I mean, you don't want to go into the one hour spiel no, here. So no. this is the Reader's Digest version. Okay, right? sure. All right. All right. Um, okay, so continuing on. So uh, once we have all of the, the individual bands uh, into the system, we have to combine them, and we can combine them through a, a multiplexer. This version is called an esiplexer, which will combine up to six separate bands. And once the bands are all combined, uh, it's, it's fed into our optics card. This optics card uh, can, can uh, provide service to either a high power or low power remote unit or any combination of. Uh, we, can, we can offer this single board, we can drive up to four remote units. So I'm going to stop and you have to go around.